Hello YouTube and welcome to a brand new episode of the Vinyl Discovery Show. As always, we're taking a look at one album, brand new, factory sealed. We're gonna open it up, take a look at what's inside as far as the printing, the pressing, the packaging. As always, this is not where you find out about the music itself. That would be in my Vinyl Survivor series, so subscribe if you wanna be kept up to date with uh, that series. This series is all about the printing, the pressing, the packaging of each album. I intend for these videos to be for two different purposes. The first purpose is for people who are thinking about purchasing uh, these albums, uh, and they can uh, sort of check out these videos and decide for themselves whether uh, they are worth purchasing and picking up for their own collection based on what, what's inside. Uh, and also I tend for these videos to be for future collectors years from now uh, to be able to, to discern whether a copy they have found in the wild perhaps used is complete or not and has, is correct or not. Uh, so multiple purposes for these videos, but as, as I said, this is not about the music. Those will be in other videos. So let's go ahead and check this out. We have the 1991 album by Guns N' Roses. This is their album, Use Your Illusion 2. This is a modern reissue of it. It says Made in the Czech Republic on the back. It is a 2LP set, uh, but non-gatefold sleeve. And this has been in print for a while now. I see these out in the wild all over the place. Uh, found a good deal on this one and decided to pick it up. This is an album from my youth. Uh, so let's go ahead and get it opened up and see what it looks like on the inside. Okay, so there it is without the shrink wrap on it. Uh, pretty nice, nicely done with the printing on the artwork. It looks it looks very sharp and very crisp and very uh, very colorful. I do like that. Let's take a look at the back here again, and we do have the numbers and that the numbers rec represent the sides. So side one has these tracks, side two has these tracks, side three has these tracks, side four has these tracks. 2LP set, as I said, non-gatefold. This is a very thin card stock on the, on the album jacket itself. All right, and on the inside, we do have printed inner sleeves, which is very nice, more photography, and uh, very, very nicely done. You know, this is, comes from the CD era, so sometimes they don't have high quality artwork to work with on these, but this, this looks very nice. It's nice to see this all blown up like this. There's side two of the first LP. You got lyrics in here as well. Very, very nice. Wasn't sure what to expect with this myself. And here is the second LP. Again, more photographs in on there, and I'm guessing more lyrics as well and liner notes again. Uh, very, very nice. Okay, that's very, very nicely done. Let's take a look at the vinyl itself. We'll look at the first LP here. So there is the first LP, it has these nice Geffen labels on them. It definitely does have a GZ vinyl inscription in the dead wax. It actually says gzvinyl.com in the dead wax. Uh, so yeah, the pressing is very nice, very flat, no non-fill, looks like it was very well done. I have, I have good experiences with GZ vinyl pressings. They are almost always completely digitally sourced. Take a quick look at the second LP here. Second LP is similar to the first, Geffen labels, and other than some uh, shreds from the from the paper sleeves, uh, very very nicely nice looking vinyl there. Uh, let's get one of these on the scale and check out the weight. Feels like 140 ish grams on the weight. Not super heavy weight, but not super light. Uh, kind of in the middle there. Okay, that one's weighed out at 136 grams, so right in that 140 gram range. Okay, so that does it for a look at this modern reissue of Guns N' Roses' Use Your Illusion 2. I would imagine a Use Your Illusion 1 will look very similar to this as far as the, the pressing and the packaging. Uh, maybe I will pick that up sometime in the future if I can find a good deal on it. But that's going to do it for this episode of the Vinyl Discovery Show. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Leave me a like, 
please subscribe down below. You'll be kept up to date with future episodes I do here on the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, great night, and we'll see you again next time. Cheers.